Well, good morning. Welcome to today's morning meeting. I'm Greg Luther, the one guy that meets with you every single day to help you in growing your real estate business. And I got some bad news for you today. We got to learn some more technology. You have to. You do not have a choice. 100% of realtors are going to have to do this. And I want to be the very first one to tell you about this. Uh, me, uh, me as a person and, and most people in the real estate game, they like things the way they are. Stop bringing all this new shit. Now I got to learn TikTok. Now I got to learn, you know, all these new things that, that was happening back when MySpace happened and then Facebook came out and then Instagram came out and then there's Pinterest and there's Twitter and there's all of these different things. And I'm like, I'm just figuring out YouTube, right? But there's a new change that's happening right now that you do not have a choice but to learn about. It's actually replacing a Google search for any data that you're looking for. We recently hired on a uh, really smart guy that's working for me here. He actually lives in Ohio, uh, not too far from me. And uh, he's a very smart guy. And he knows a little bit about AI, artificial intelligence. Now, I know you've heard about this and you've completely ignored it. When I was a kid, that was like some stuff that the CIA did to uh, spy on you, that they had these secret approaches or whatever. AI is a very real thing and it is affecting real estate. Uh, there are some agents that are now using AI to write their property descriptions, and they're getting better results. The computer is always smarter than the human. So I went, I spent the weekend going down this rabbit hole to do all the research I can to test some things out, to try some things so that you as a realtor can say, damn it, I got to learn another thing here. I don't have a choice. I can't ignore it because I'm going to become a dinosaur. Greg told me this is something I need to be checking out. It is very, very early stages, but I've been impressed with it. It's, it's so much better than doing a Google search on something. So let me give you an example. I, uh, I'm looking on my phone here because I screenshotted some of this. Uh, you've probably heard of chat GPT. That's what is threatening Google and everybody's worried that's going to take it over and that type of thing. Uh, and man, there are millions and millions of people using this younger folks, right, that understand the, the 20s and the 30s that understand there's a better way for them to run their business. So what I did was I went in there and I said, okay, I want to ask it a question, just like you would type it into, uh, into Google. I'm going to ask it a question. And I said, um, give me five TikTok ideas for real estate. That was it. Give me five TikTok ideas for real estate. Okay, let's see what it says. It's going to say something stupid. It's going to have stuff that's not even relevant. It's going to have all of that. And it just starts typing. It's grabbing all this data. And I can see it like typing right on my screen on my phone. It's typing out these five ideas as quickly as it's finding them from the internet, finding the most relevant, finding this is the, what's getting the best results. This one's getting the best hits. This has the most shareability. This is creating the followers and the fans and the clients that they're looking for. And it's typing them out for freaking free. Let me give you the five ideas it gave me. Pretty good. Showcase a new listing. Create a short video tour of a recently listed property, highlighting its key features and location. You can also use the video to share information about the local neighborhood and community. Number two, share home staging tips. Home staging can help buyers visualize themselves living in that property. Share some of the favorite staging ideas and techniques, such as how to arrange furniture or what colors to paint the walls. Number three, offer a virtual open house. Many buyers are unable to attend in-person open houses these days due to travel restrictions, health concerns, or ease of use. Use TikTok to host a virtual open house showcasing the property and answering viewer questions in real time, which gets them pixeled. Number four, share market updates. Keep your followers up to date on the latest real estate trends in your area. You could share statistics on recent home sales, current mortgage rates, which is a big one, or the state of the local real estate market. And then number five, offer advice for first-time home buyers. TikTok is popular with younger audiences, many of them who are now first-time home buyers and running searches for this information on TikTok. Offer tips and advice on the home buying process, such as how to get a mortgage or what to consider when looking at a home how important it is to have a real estate agent, and much more. You could also share resources such as online mortgage calculators, 
free home buying guides that teach you about the home buying process. Not bad. A lot better than what a Google search would find. I should have said 12 TikTok ideas for real estate instead of five. But this is this shows you where the world is going. The new pipeline that's starting to be created for information because it really ever the whole world is just data. It's all just gathered data. So that is readily available for you as a real estate agent and it's free. Now you might be thinking, oh my gosh, I don't know how to do all this stuff. Uh, I went to chat GPT and I typed in, or you can even speak it. Give me five ideas for TikTok for real estate. That's what I did. You do it on Google already. You're essentially running a Google search on a different website. But artificial intelligence is going crazy right now. Some of the stuff that we're doing in our marketing, we're utilizing AI for the hashtags that we utilize. So, um, you know, which hashtag should we use if we're trying to market to real estate agents? You could do which hashtag should we use if we're marketing for luxury home sellers? So lots and lots of information. It's so damn early in the process. I don't even know what I'm talking about, but I want you to be aware of it. And I just want you to bend an ear a little bit as you're learning about this. There's tons of stuff online about don't buy anything. You don't need any of that stuff right now, but I want you to learn about it. Start playing around with it a little bit. Your clients are sure to ask you if you're using AI. And as we start to make this work for property descriptions, for target marketing, for all of those things, we will be baking it into the listing presentations, which gives you a huge advantage. I want you to imagine you go to a listing appointment tonight, and the first thing you say is, yeah, uh, we actually utilize AI in our marketing, and here's how that gets us superior results. Let me show you some examples compared to what regular agents do. Game over, 7.5% if you know how to present it the right way. Charge what you want. I don't care what percentage you charge, but I'm giving you an example. You can get a premium. So this is a pretty cool approach. Um, it is truly taking over the world. Uh, let me tell you, if you're better than Google, Google is all info on the internet. That's literally what it is. It is the, the search engine for the world. This is beating it. It's getting better results. It's getting more thought out rather than, you know, keywords that made it come up in the Google search or they paid money for it to come up in the Google search. This is seeing these five ideas are getting the best results. So that's what we're going to give you. These five ideas are getting more buyers to look at it, more sellers to look at it. So that's what we're going to give you. It's pretty cool. I don't know anything about it. I'm doing a training class on a program I don't understand. I don't think five years from now we'll understand it. But one thing I do know how to do is I know how to jump on there and run a search, and I get some damn good results from it. So if you're trying to get marketing ideas, if you're trying to get real estate, uh, the right type of leads, that type of stuff, this may start to help us with our target marketing approach. Uh, we're going to be playing with it, learning about it. I'm hiring on some of the uh, best people that I can find. We're running that search now. Uh, for those that are kind of pros at this, because it's millions and millions and millions of dollars worth of opportunity. Uh, so I think it's going to be a big, big deal for us that way. But uh, I kind of got going down the rabbit hole, checking it out. I'm pretty impressed. Very, very impressed with what I saw. So uh, I watched a uh, um, video blog or podcast of Tom Bilio. So if you guys know Tom Bilio from uh, Quest Bars, uh, very good guy to learn from. And uh, he did one on AI. What the heck was that thing called? I was watching it this morning. Uh, he did one on there called Use AI to Get Ahead While Others Panic. Uh, you'll find that on YouTube. Use AI, just the two letters, no periods. Use AI to get ahead while others panic. And that's from Tom Bilyeu. So uh, pretty good art or pretty good uh, video there uh, that will kind of break the ice for you a little bit. So uh, anyway, to get you thinking uh, on today's episode of shit, I'm turning into a dinosaur realtor and I can't keep up with all this stuff. Artificial intelligence is certainly one of those things. So uh, I do believe this is something you cannot ignore. Uh, trust me, you could ignore Facebook. You can ignore uh, TikTok. You can ignore the new software program, the new CRM, the whatever. I don't think you're going to be able to ignore this one. 
I truly think it's taking over just about everything that we do. I mean, look, the, if a doctor can go there and uh, go to the chat GPT and say, uh, what are the best antibiotics for bronchitis? And it shows by actual stats and results. And then the best doctors in the world agree. Oh my gosh, that is definitely the best info. Come on. This is crazy. So we'll see what happens here. Start playing around with it. You'll have some fun. But uh, my, my message for you today is simply as a real estate agent, don't go down the rabbit hole. Keep selling houses. Keep doing what you're doing. But anytime you're hearing something about it, just lean in a little bit. Just listen a little bit. It's going to take some time, but we'll learn this stuff. What I don't want you to do is say, oh, I don't understand that stuff. I'm just going to keep sending postcards. All right? Be cautiously optimistic. Be uh, open to learning a little bit here. I think you'll find it very helpful. By the way, uh, we got a whole lot of agents that have had a phenomenal start to 2023. Damn, we're doing well. Uh, I got some more testimonials yesterday. We just finished up the January closings, and so many agents are having a phenomenal year already. Hopefully, that's you as well. If you are not a coaching member, look at the video description down here. There's a couple of links that will help you, but uh, make sure you're following this page and you ring the bell. You turn on notifications. We'll have some cool stuff for you there. So. Uh, today, I decided to wear my pixelated computer artificial intelligence galaxy shirt in honor of our topic this morning. So uh, go out there, make it a profitable week. Let me know what I can do to help you in any way, and we'll talk to you soon. I am the bot used to be Greg Luther today, and we'll see you. Bye-bye.